Hi everyone, The Lone Wolf here. Welcome back to some EVE Online. And in today's video, I want to talk about compression because a little bit to my surprise, I still regularly receive questions about compression. Uh, what is it and where can I do it, for instance? So let's start with the basics. Where can you compress ore? You can compress ore in any structure, whether it's a citadel or an engineering complex that has a reprocessing facility. So the easiest way to spot that would be to go to your structure browser. You can find this in the Neocom E, then business structure browser. And you can have a my structure list, but you can also have an all structure list, which for instance, you can set on the solar system itself. Probably one of the most uh, useful settings here. And then you can look for this little icon here, reprocessing plant, reprocessing plant in the Atlantis Kingdom, in KPMG, uh, and a Strauss. Then here we also have reprocessing plant in Co-Incorporated, of course, that's my own. And here in the um, Asbel, uh, which is uh, Scara Admiralty, full industrial service and market, you also have a reprocessing plant. And once you see that on a structure, you know that you can also compress your ore. Very useful, of course, if you're planning to move your ore, because you can reduce the volume, the place it'll take in your cargo hold by quite a lot. Uh, this is also why I'm mining. I'm just gonna quickly show to you guys uh, how you compress in one of those structures. It's really the easiest way to do it. And I think uh, pretty soon everyone is going to just use only this form of compression. It's not really worth it to go uh, for a Rorcal or something like that, especially in Heisek where it's not even possible. Um, in the meantime, a quick side note, you can see here that I'm mining in the Orca and I was now at uh, 1,600. Uh, and 65 cubic meters a minute. So it's uh, it's like uh, the, the best possible yield. I have augmented drones, I have full rigs, and by now I also have the full skills uh, trained. I personally don't think it's that bad. Uh, the ISK here is, is uh, so low because it's just regular Veldspar that I'm mining. But in general, I think I can do uh, like uh, a million in four, uh, in four minutes, even at the current decently low prices for ores and minerals. So the most straightforward way again for compression, look for a structure in your structure browser, business structure browser, all structures that has a reprocessing plant in it. And that will allow you to, uh, uh, to, to do compression as well. You can even see the tax rate here too. 0.10%, 0.5%, 0% in mine, 2.9% in uh, in the Asbel. That's uh, that's actually uh, pretty pretty high considering the rest uh, of, um, of of the local reprocessing facilities. But yeah, very easy to spot, very easy to find. You just need to remember if there is reprocessing, you can also compress. Another option uh, that uh, would be available to most players that would be looking for this information is your own boss. So player own star base, you have to anchor that at the moon. You also need to fuel it, but then you could also anchor a compression plant. Um, inside the POS and then you have your own compression facility as well. The biggest advantage of doing it from your own structure or from your own POS of course is that taxes go to your corp um, wallet and thus you basically uh, don't have to uh, care too much about the, uh, the extra taxes, not the NPC taxes, but the extra taxes that can be levied on top. Uh, in the meantime we've got some Sancha bad guys coming in so we're quickly going to swap. Let's see if we don't get the drone bug no we don't that's good so quickly switching to my hops here and um yeah i wanted to show you guys the compression plant so for that we'll go to the market then we go to structures we have star based structures compression array so you need a control tower which you can only anchor at the moon and then you want the compression array which will uh, allow you to do compression inside a POS. You just bring your ore there, right click, press compress, and there you go, it's, uh, it's done. Um, I think it's exactly the same numbers as what you would get inside uh, a structure. Um, he's only using one, what is this one? He's only using one of goblin. Let's quickly help uh, our Koda, uh, Kodara Tser out here by uh, going after these little guys. You know, this is the co-incorporated belt, so we have to uh, make sure that it's, uh, that it's cleared. 
for anyone else that wants to mine here. So let's do that. Next up, we get Sanchez Savage. Blop. And then the Slave Hunter. We can quickly try to help out. Blap return in case he wants to uh, salvage that stuff as well. Let's uh, abandon the Rex. And then let's dock up here. We have a little bit of ore. I also mined a little bit more uh, yesterday. So we can uh, actually do a little bit of compression just like that. Oh, we're in the vulnerable cycle for another 26 minutes. Luckily, there is no war deck anymore. So we can take the skinned orca out here absolutely love it black and white looks awesome and then uh, let's quickly to end the video here show a run of compression it's it's really very simple you just right click press compress the one thing that i don't like about the service is that uh, you don't get an in-between window which for refining you do get so you also don't get a chance to check for potential uh, increase in value for uh, your compression activity or anything like that it'll just straight turn your ores into compressed variants uh, maybe another side note to remember if you compress and then you refine, you get the exact same results as if you would just refine the ore. So there is no loss there. The only loss is, of course, that you have to possibly pay a little bit in order to actually do the compression. And then again for the refining. But other than that, uh, it's 100% uh, it's, it's perfectly efficient to compress everything and uh, to refine at the best possible place uh, if, if that's what you want to do. So let's move the ore into my inventory into the item hanger and here now you can see that I've got uh, yeah a little bit of concentrated and normal and dense fell spar as well let's maybe start with that uh, you just right click and then you press compress and up oh, there we go they're gone from here and I think they'll add them here so we have 400 and, uh, and two uh, compressed concentrated veld spar for instance and you could check the values like this uh, but of course it's too late now. I didn't check the previous values. So let's maybe press stack all. Uh, but yeah, personally, so if you press refine, let's uh, maybe press refine on something really small like this massive scordite, which doesn't have enough to compress. If I press refine, you get this in between window and you get an idea of the estimated value um, so that is unfortunate. I would like to see this with the compression as well, just to get more information out there. Seems pretty intuitive. So here we have uh, Scordite, around 18,000 Scordite, worth 347,000 is estimated value. So now if I press compress, compress, um, the stacks that can be compressed are compressed. And here we go, worth 448,000 is So definitely not bad. Take a quick look at, uh, maybe it doesn't show up in my wallet here because I really don't ask for any taxes and so you don't have to pay for anything. Let's take a look in the transactions. No, don't really see anything. What about the corp wallet? Yeah, is it uh, this? Zero. No, nope, that's the corp jobs. Reprocessing tax of zero does show up for compression. I don't even see it. That's a little bit strange. Transactions, anything to be spotted there? No. So unfortunately, I can't really show that off too well. Uh, but maybe we'll quickly take... Yeah, you know what? Just to be complete, again, I think the, the basic questions here are answered. Look for reprocessing and you'll be able to compress. It's really going to be the easiest and most intuitive way to do this. Uh, unfortunately, I can't really show you what happens with the taxes. So I'm going to take uh, some of this stuff. Let's take some Pyroxeris in the fast TP. And we'll move to the Asbel with the 2.9% tax rate. And we'll do a compression there as well to take a look at, uh, at what happens for that. Because I can't find anything in the wallet. So let's head to the Asbel with 888,000 worth of... Um, Pyroxeris, and I will uh, will take a look at what's going to happen uh, in my wallet for those taxes. So I think it should just show up in my journal, which uh, at the moment the last entry is from yesterday. And is that contract sale 18? No, that contract sale. So yeah, nothing to be spotted for the activity that I've done in my own um, citadel. 
let's see what happens here. So again, um, we've seen from the, I'll quickly show it once again, from the business uh, structure browser here that this one has reprocessing with a 2.9% reprocessing tax rate. And I think, so if we go here now, I can just press right click compress. It's compressed to uh, 1.1 million in value, not bad. And a tax, oh, no taxes. Okay, there you go. I thought you would need to pay a tax just like with reprocessing. It's not, it's a free service that you get uh, inside, um, inside the structure for reprocessing. Very interesting, of course, there, there is absolutely no reason not to compress uh, if, if we look at it from that point of view. It's gonna make it easier for you to transport the ores if you need it. And if you would reprocess that, you would get the exact same result um, as, um, as reprocessing straight up the ore. Maybe we can also confirm that if I go to the Strauss. Let's do that. So we have 207 compressed, which was, yeah, good question. How much was that? Well, that's okay. I can make two stacks inside my own citadel. So there we go. Just to make it as complete as possible. It's it's kind of weird. Um, hello. Uh, it, it's kind of weird to me that there are still so many people asking about compression. And so I tr I'm trying to be as thorough as possible here. But it, it's pretty intuitive. Um, it's easy to find and it's very easy to do. And as you can see here, there is absolutely no reason not to do it. So let's uh, put up two stacks of regular pyroxeres. Let's uh, get this in half, take 30,000 and take 30,000 like that. Let's put my minerals away so we don't have any and then we'll uh, we'll be able to confirm oh damn i press stack all that's that's silly Thirty thousand, which should be round enough to compress 30k again which should be round enough to compress and so we'll do one compressed compress which turns into 300 compressed pyroxeres and i will do a refine reprocess which turns into, well, the easiest to remember is going to be 1117 Noxium. So let's press reprocess, no costs. Put that into the second division. And 1117. And now if I press reprocess this baby, 1117, there you go. The exact same amount of minerals uh, is what you get for reprocessing the compressed ores and we've just seen now that i do get two bills of zero isk which is only the tax that uh, that uh, the uh, the player itself can levy um, for the reprocessing so again the um uh, the, the result of this clearly shows that uh, you want to compress because it is free and you want to then of course uh, reprocess in at the best possible yield and at the lowest possible tax rate which is all easily uh, spotable in the structure browser right here just hover over the reprocessing plant and you get the tax rate right there which uh, yeah, it's free here, so a little bit of, uh, of a commercial for co-incorporated reprocessing. Feel free to compress and drop by for best possible yield and completely free reprocessing service over here. There you go. I hope that that helps a little bit. Uh, there is one last option for compression, which is from the Rorcal. Uh, but uh, honestly, if you've gotten to the point where you have questions uh, or where you're going to compress in a Rorcal, I think you know all of these basi basics as well. This video is aimed at newer players that, uh, that want to know what compression is all about, where they can do it, what the costs are, and if there are any drawbacks. And the answer is any structure with reprocessing, um, the costs depend on what the player said. Very easy to st spot in the structure browser. And finally, the conclusion, there is no reason not to uh, compress your ore wherever you are. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you all next time.